I'm really Vince KW, and I am Shannon Ferris with Tony Luna, the Executive Director of SAVE. We are here today uh, at a fundraising event at Salt Fusion uh, for the same-sex uh, marriage uh, and in Island Marotta. And you are here today, and this is something new because this has happened not that long ago that you came on board because you're, you do not live in Monroe County. I don't. I don't. I have a personal connection to Monroe County. My um, my partner and, and future husband, the minute that it's legal in Florida, grew up in Monroe. He grew up in on, on Grassy Key and in Key Largo. So I have a, a very strong personal connection. My in-laws actually still live in Tavernier. So I'm happy to be here. Um, I, I represent SAVE. We're Safeguarding American Values for Everyone, which is the largest LGBT rights organization in South Florida. Now in its 20 21st year, 21st year, um, and we we were also plaintiffs in the federal marriage recognition case, along with the ACLU of Florida. So the issue of marriage equality, alongside from the ideology of it being very important to the organization, we've also lived what it's like to be a plaintiff in a very visible, visible case. So for us, it's about really standing in solidarity with Aaron and, and with Lee and with their plight in Monroe County, and we really want to be as, as supportive as possible. I mean, in the end, if we pass marriage equality in Monroe, um, it'll it'll trickle to have an effect in the rest of the state, like my case and the Miami-Dade case, and we really want to be a part of just making it happen in general for our state. Well, it is a, a part of the entire state, and even um, hopefully if and when this case. When? Uh, <laughs> um, and, and those of us and the rest of the Florida residents that are legally married in other states will also instantly be rec recognized by exactly. the state of Florida. And so, you, and that part is moving forward as well. Right. And so, I just want the viewers to know um, very quickly, what are uh, some of the main areas that, that SAVE supports? And then, in which I think the viewers then will see exactly why you're here. Today. Sure. So, SAVE is part foundation and part political organization. Through the foundation side, we educate the community at large to the issues that are important. For example, um, non-discrimination when it comes to the workforce is a big issue that we work on locally in Miami-Dade County, and we're also working on the plight to bring the Competitive Workforce Act to life at the state level. Um, also, marriage equality, as we just talked about, it's something that we've been advocating for on our foundation side on why it's important not only to recognize the marriages of, of people, same sex couples that have been married in other states but living in Florida, but also why it's important to challenge the terrible man. Um, so those are those are two of the things that we do partly within our foundation, but then on the political end of our organization, we also groom and help elect pro equality leaders. Not necessarily leaders that are openly gay. I mean, that's part of it as well, but leaders who are pro-equality in general. Well, you did so, say equality, so it doesn't matter what exactly, the sexual orientation Exactly. Is. Good point. So that's part of what we do. We endorse um, in all of the, the municipalities in Miami-Dade County. We're actively endorsing in Monroe, endorsing in Broward County. And I spend a lot of my time in Tallahassee with State Representative David Richardson, working with him on any and all LGBT legislation. Are there a couple of politicians that we should be watching that would be helping you with your effort? You know, I think that for us it's important to keep people like, and at this point she doesn't have an opponent, but Holly Rashin, who represents this area, is very important. She's a Republican who's moderate and is the main sponsor of the Competitive Workforce Act. And also here today in this country. She is. She is here today, thankfully. She's very supportive of the community. So people like Holly Rashi, people like State Representative David Richardson, who was the first openly gay legislator in the state of Florida, these are the people that are, at a statewide level, advocating for our rights and making sure that there's legislation, ordinances, anything necessary to make sure that we're protected and that we enjoy the same freedoms and protections as the rest of the community. So those are two that I would note. It's also a huge election year. We need to go out and vote for our pro-equality governor, Charlie Crist. He's really our chance for marriage equality, for the passing of a non-discrimination um, law. He is really the one that can take, it to, take us to that next level from a statewide perspective. And where can we get this information? Um, I would say you could go to our website. Right now it is www.savedade.org and I have to give a caveat for that. Sure. We were Save Dade for almost 20 years before we just became Save and started doing work in Monroe and in Broward. 
Um, and our website will be changing at the beginning of next year, so it's representative of that. But for now, www.savedave.org, or find us on Facebook under Save, or on Twitter under Save, and follow us. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank it's my pleasure to be here. Thank you for being on board with Aaron and Eve. We know that it's not just an individual case. It's a statewide challenge. It is. It is. And it really, I mean, they're wonderful guys, and we want to make sure that, that they, they can live the American dream, so to speak, like most of the community can. But it really isn't only about them. It's about everybody else. It's about the community at large. It's about the state. So we're happy to be here. We're happy to be supporting. And we look forward to a series of, of victories, hopefully very, very soon, very so we can soon. all enjoy marriage equality. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank Take you. Care. Thanks. Bye-bye. Where you need to be, so we challenge all of you to step up, tell your friends, your family members, people that you know that believe in love, because that's all this is, is a belief in love and in the, in the right that every individual has to be able to marry the partner of their choice. To step up and give us some money so these guys can get to where they need to be.